What is up, my dudes? It is Warstar93. And I know it's been a while since I've done these little vlogs in my car. Uh, last week, I was actually sick for, like, literally half the week. I lost my voice for, like, like Thursday to the whole entire weekend. And my voice is still kind of scratchy, but it's getting better. And what I want to talk about today is I graduated May 10th. It was a Friday, like two weeks ago, from Metro, where... I've been going for a very long time and it's been a really long good journey and I didn't really think I would actually ever graduate or actually achieve my goal and get a degree. It's a, uh, my degree is in associates in business management slash nutrition and actually walking on stage wearing a cap and gown and I'm just thinking I actually did it. I actually made my goal. And my goal was to actually graduate and walk across the stage with a bunch of people. There was over about 700 people, over a thousand, you know, family members and stuff. Uh, my family was there. I got a couple of pictures. Um, and now, today, it's so like two weeks later, May 22nd. It's my last day here at Metro, actually. It feels really weird. Uh, yeah, it actually just, to me, it feels really weird. And I'm gonna actually kind of miss doing these little vlogs, little gatherings here in the car at Metro. It's my last. And today I actually had my communications class. I had to turn in my final paper. That final paper was five pages long. It's about when Harry met Sally, the movie. I bought it off of the PlayStation. It was like $10. And it was actually worth it. I watched it eight times last night and stayed up drinking Red Bull. So usually college students usually stay up for a long time drinking random stuff or caffeine just to actually stay awake doing your work. And that's what I did for my last day. And I actually didn't really want to finish the page because I know it's going to be forever. And you had to cut it down, like different scenes from the movie. And I had to write a bunch of theories. There's four theories I, I wrote about my interpersonal communication class. And actually overthinking it, when I got done, I was happy. Because it's my last essay ever here at Metro. I wrote my little short essay about challenges, competition, achieving goals yesterday from my marketing class and today just thinking about it it was just like I don't know it just feels weird to me I'm thinking I'm gonna come back in the fall when I'm actually not gonna come back in the fall um I'm done actually and my friends are still gonna stick around here because they have they're, they're not gonna graduate until May and when you walk across the stage you'll know you'll have that feeling that you actually did it and why I actually stuck around to the last day of like today is because uh, I actually talked to the Metro people saying that what I actually have to continue my classes. There's two classes I have. I knew those are the classes I needed to graduate and I stuck around to actually finish them and I actually wanted to see my final grade and feedback from the essays and that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get my feedback. I know I got one of my essays today and it was uh the last time I actually saw it the grade was low it was pretty low and it's like no and I got like a d on it and then I redid it and it shot up from like a 77 to a 92 and it's like whoa I didn't think that would I'm proving it would actually shoot it up but it actually did um I do recommend if you guys are gonna go to college or school Motivate yourself to just continue going to school. Don't give up. It took me a long, long time, but I achieved my goal slowly. I chose a path before I didn't have a path. Uh, I kind of sort of did, and then I had my business nutrition. <coughs> <coughs> See, I got sick, and I chose my path, and my path wasn't through nutrition, and I actually achieved that. I'm not crying or anything, 
is just trying to get over this sickness is tough and getting my voice back is kind of tough but i actually recommend you just to continue going to school don't give up there's a quote i actually go by it's from bowtrack horseman the jogging baboon i'll put the quote down below it's about not giving up it's hard but you gotta do it every day literally that's what i did i went by that quote because I like that quote. It kind of reminds me of like the Lion King, the Rafiki giving inspiration, motivation to Simba. So with that quote, I actually went by because it was, everything is hard for me in life. I actually have a learning disability and it actually affected me in school. I was slower, but I eventually got my goal. I actually completed my goal like getting my license I never really thought I would drive because it actually affected it but I studied and if you study in school you will eventually overcome your 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 goal and this is what I did I actually do recommend you guys just to continue going to school I'm gonna go back probably in the fall I'm gonna go to UNO it's a big university so I'm going to get my bachelor's and then eventually my master's and maybe the PhD. I don't know. I might. I'm just going to continue going to school. I kind of want to go to get like an English degree and maybe come back to Metro and teach. I don't know. I kind of do. I want to get my either my English or my marketing. Since I'm in business, I kind of want to go into the marketing here and come back and teach eventually. I had a marketing teacher and he kind of inspired me. And then I'm going to actually use my business degree to probably just get like a management job. Or I actually want to open up my own business in nutrition. My own supplements. Plant-based or stuff like that. Supplements. I actually follow on Instagram. If you want to follow me on Instagram, it's Warstone93. It's links down below. Also, go check out my gaming channel. It's down the line it's below. I try to upload new stuff. Since I couldn't upload for about two weeks because I got sick, I have a bunch of free time now. I'm free from college. So yeah, I graduated and I'm actually happy. I'm hyped. So I'm happy to actually just go back to streaming, not really focusing on all these work essays and quizzes and stuff like that. Hope you guys do enjoy. And I hope I kind of motivated you guys to go back to school, continue going to school. But yeah, I actually graduated and I'm class of 2019. Thanks for watching my dudes. Peace.